to get to the uh, Flat Earth mailbag, you'll notice that the title of this video is called Flat Earth Drama because there's been a lot of stuff going on. I'm not going to get real specific on a lot of topics, uh, but uh, before we get to the phone calls and the emails, we've got to address some things when it comes to what's going on in the Flat Earth movement. And uh, like I was saying on Patricia's show uh, just recently, when it comes to the to the Flat Earth, I know it excites a lot of people. I, and I've seen it so many times where I get emails and I get phone calls and people get super charged up, really motivated. They make videos uh, and they want the world to change now, now, now. And it doesn't. It doesn't change right this second. Again, Rome was not built in a day. The Flat Earth movement is gaining leaps and bounds every day. Uh, it, it's And it's hitting all cylinders and it's going great. Uh, so, but there's going to be some frustration out there and unfortunately people turn on other people, which is why, uh, at the beginning, hopefully I don't get hit with the copyright thing uh, at the beginning of this video. If you're watching this on YouTube, uh, I included a little snippet from a twilight zone episode called, uh, the monsters are due on maple street. By the way, I was correcting myself. I initially said Elm street, but it's actually maple street where people, you know, develop the mob mentality. And it really wasn't as much a twilight Z uh, zone episode as it was, uh, a take on what we are as a civilization, what we have been for for a very long time, and it seems to be holding true yet again. And that is dissension in the ranks. Uh, it's you know, please, you know, for those of you who are listening out there and are having a hard time, look, focus on the work. Don't lash out at each other. Uh, it's it's not constructive. And honestly, there's so much content out there. The foundation for the flat Earth movement is so thick and solid right now. It's got a life of its own already. So what you're doing, you're 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 just spending energy that's not gonna uh, not gonna help anything. So please, I, I know I'm 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 being kind of preachy here, and I'm I'm going down the flat Earth friendship path, but I really do mean it. Uh, <clears throat> and for those people that have emailed me and said, you know, what's the deal going on with Tiger Dan? Because you know, of all the people that have been dealing with a lot of stress lately, Tiger Dan seems to have uh, snapped. I do not know what's going on with him. He and I have not really corresponded. And I, he was not on the show, and so I don't know what, what's going on with him. I know that he was working on trying to build a new map of the Flat Earth, ran into some sort of brick wall when it, when it came to the logic, and something happened to him uh, during this process, and he started lashing out at everybody, saying that you know the flat earth, there was a lot of liars in the Flat Earth movement, but he still says that he's Flat Earth. So I'm not saying necessarily cut him slack, just understand that people will – you know, there, there's there's going to be some some brain fry. People are going to lose it. Uh, you you who is listening right now? Again, everything it hits people different. Remember when you were first listening to the flat Earth and going, "This is nuts. This is crazy. I'm not even listening to it." And then when you finally got into it, uh, you got supercharged up. That energy has to go somewhere, and not all of it's going to be positive. So uh, just keep it together, guys. We will make it through this. Uh, you know, uh, I'm going to be. Doing what I can, beating on the drum, carrying the flag, doing whatever I can, spreading the word. Uh, and I'm going to stay uh, as positive as I can while, uh, you know, while doing all this stuff. The other thing I want to mention that <laughs> that that is there is a new troll thing happening out there, and I just want to make people aware of it. This is more of a warning than anything else. And that is that there seems to be an exploit, a weakness in the YouTube process, which allows people to make replicas, doppelgangers, impersonations, whatever, of a legitimate channel. And I know this because I've seen it happen now on multiple Flat Earthers, and, and Flat Earthers have really been taking the brunt of this. Uh, the first one that I saw was Jaronism, because I saw a new Jaronism channel, which looked identical to the old one, same name, same logo. The videos were being uploaded, and a guy was actually taking donations. And when I asked Jaron, I was going, why are you re-uploading your stuff? He said, I have no idea what you're talking about. So... Uh, and then the, the the sub part of that is that you will see these people, what they'll do is they will go use that channel and go into people's forums and their videos and start making comments. And most of them are really horrible. And so, but, but when you look at it at a glance, you go, wait, hey, why did Jaredism say those horrible things? And it's not Jared or it's not uh, flat earth and other hot potatoes, or it's not the Morgyle. It's, it's none of these people. They're, they're all impersonations. So if you see some, postings out there and they look a little out of place 
please either hover your mouse over it because it should pop up a box that show you how many, you know, uh, the, the key is the subscribers. If you don't see any subscribers, that's a dead giveaway. Also, if you click on it and it pops into, you know, goes into their uh, the homepage and you don't see any videos, and there's nothing there. It's just a shell. Then you also know. So please, please be careful. Do not judge comments too quickly. Uh, again, if you see something strange, click on the click on whoever it is and figure out if it's the real person or not. And uh, there's not a lot of trolls doing this, but it's enough that it's getting uh, annoying. Uh, and and we've avoided some some pretty awkward moments, I think, so far. But you know, just just be aware of it. Um, what else? Oh yeah, me. Uh, 